Okay, everybody. I don't know how good you can see that, but here we are, set up at Moore Auction House. Right there's a prep table, cooler full of pop in water, the hot dog cart with a menu board, my 4.99 umbrella, my 15 foot hot dog stand or flag, and then the hot dog signs. Um, I just got it up and running. Hopefully I'll get a customer here shortly. Would be nice. But I do have me a hot a sausage right now and a bottle of water. I haven't ate yet today and it's 11 o'clock so I better get something in me. Got plenty of traffic. Been open for about 20 minutes so far. I haven't sold anything yet. But, you know, people don't know I'm here right now, so... Might not sell anything today, but the next time I'm down here, might sell $200 worth. I have no idea. But I need to be on here on a regular schedule, so I'm going to have to start doing this every Tuesdays and Thursdays. We don't have any quarter pound hot dogs. I forgot those left them in the refrigerator. But we do have hot dogs and Polish sausages. So that's a shame too, because I make a lot of money off of the quarter pounders. Uh, so far, I've had six customers. It's 12:52. I didn't get a single customer till after 12 o'clock. Not doing too bad, I guess. I'm making a ton of money, but I've made more money than what I've got into it right now. So I don't know. Maybe we'll uh, maybe we'll make some money. Hopefully. What the thing of it is is. I'm not been here. Last time I was here was like the, I don't know, like the 12th of May. And uh, then I had to have surgery, so on the 25th. Um, so I, I couldn't make it back here till after, well, today is the 11th of Ju uh, July. So that's how long it's been since I, I haven't sold a hot dog actually since May 18th. So it's been almost two months. But we've had 35 days worth of rain in that last 50 days or 55 days or whatever. So you can't sell nothing if you're sitting in the, you know, in the weather, in the rain. We've got a customer right now. Well, that gentleman, he just bought two Polish sausages and a pop and a chip. He got the meal deal for $7. That was a good buy for him, good buy for me. Goodbye, Polish sausage, goodbye. Goodbye, Polish sausage. Seven dollars for two Polish sausages. That's what I, I normally get three bucks a piece. And then you throw in a chip and a pop, you got seven dollars. Um, you know, a lot of people say, ah, I don't want the chip. You know, well, you know, you take the chip and you get, you know, you get it for seven bucks. It's a meal deal. Exactly what it is, it's a meal deal. Yeah, hasn't been all that busy, but like I said before, I haven't been here for over a month and a half. Well, here comes the owner of the place right now. All right, remember me telling you about uh, the new sausages we're going to have? This is one of them. This is a Polish sausage. As you can tell, it's the size of a dinner plate. Let me get back. See how big that is? Uh, it's made with pork and beef. It's a name brand uh, sausage. On this one I have mustard, onion, and cheese. I've never tried them, 
Uh, this is the first one we're going to, Kathy's got hers, I got mine, I'm going to try it. And if we like them, we're putting them on the cart. Um, it may be called uh, Grab a Big Dog uh, instead of Grab a Dog. But uh, it does look good. And like I said, it is coming from a name brand sausage maker. Everybody's had the sausages that they make. But this is different, so. And that is a foot long bun, so hey. It does look good.